Hi, this is Ms. Hilda Reyes, and we're going to learn how to access our Head Sprouts program. So when you first open your internet, what that can be on your phone, that can be on your computer or your tablet, you will have an internet page, kind of like this. Or you might have some other pages, like I have lots of them up here. So I just clicked on the plus sign at the end to get a new tab. Once I'm in the new tab, I click on the URL browser, and when I click on it, it goes down and I can type in where I want to go. So I want to go to kidsa-z.com. Now it may already produce the words for you and you can just click enter, or it may not and you have to type the whole kidsa-z.com and then you hit enter. When you do that, you will get a site that looks like this. Your old teacher might be in here. If your old teacher is in here, you need to click underneath it where it says add new teacher. And then you put your teacher username. If you are in my class, you are going to put in A-H-I-L-D-E-L-R-E-Y-E-S zero. Do not put an O, it has to be a zero. And then click go. Now, once I put that in, so from now on, this page is going to appear. So it'll make it easy the second time around. Then I have to find my name. My name is Andrea HR. I'm the gold star. Click on it. And when you first go in there, it'll come to this page and it'll ask you for your student name. Now, this is not my password. So I need to just click at the end and hit the backspace button to delete it. And then I need to put my password. You saw I had a lot of students that used my computer and they all saved their password, believe it or not. Now on your computer, you need to save your password. When you go on someone else's computer, don't save your password. And then click go. Once I get to go, I get to this page. Isn't it amazing? Look at all this cool stuff. I have vocabulary, I have writing, I have reading, I have science, and here's what I really want, the green world that says head sprouts. So I'll click on it. As soon as I click on there, I have a little tree house and I have an empty tree. Once I really work on my tree house, I'll get books and there will be a book room that appears right here too cool. So, but right now I need to first take my placement test. So I click at the open door and this is where you're going to go every single time to work. When you work, you just click on it. Hi V. So I click on it. Remember that when they ask you to say something or read aloud, you need to do that. V is sleeping and she feels cold. San sees V sleeping. Could V feel cold? Oh, this is San. This is V, but she's not sleeping. So this must be the right picture. San holds the sheet. Oh, he's not holding a sheet. He's holding, he's cutting the sheet. <gasps> Here he holds the sheet. V feels the sheet. Her feet feel colder. San sees her feet. Her feet. Oh, no. No, no. I think it's this one. Now, as far as you get, it will place where you're at. So when you're done, I'm going to click on all the wrong ones now. Oh, look, clicking on the wrong one. Just so you can see the placement test. So then it'll ask me to do more stuff. When you're done, there will be a path that appears with little bubbles, and it will tell you what level you are on. Once the level is determined, you need to do the next level every single day. Now you know your teacher checks your levels every day, so do your work just like if you were in school. And when you come to school, you still have to do your head sprouts every single day. I am so excited. I can't wait to see how far you go with your head sprouts. So. Keep working. I'm checking. And I will, when you're done, do you see on the top here it says log out? Then you can log out. Do not think you're done until you see that path with the pebbles. I know I cut it short because this video is only so long. And I want to see you do the entire episode. See you later.